This project came out of research related to issues that farmers face because of the ongoing California drought and the current methods they use for irrigating their crops. Currently, most farmers' greenhouses do not use any type of targeted or measured irrigation system. And the goal of this project was to prove that a precision irrigation system could save quite a bit of water. We've maintained constant light uh, so through those tube lights, and, and also it's in a sheltered area to prevent any impact of outside temperature or, or water. In this setup, you can see the four Galileo boxes up above, monitoring the data and sending them directly to the cloud. Whenever the touch sensor passes two railings and hits them both, it will know that you're near a plant so it'll stop and adjust itself by going back one centimeter so the plant will be able to get its amount of water. Now what you're seeing here is the beagle bone black that's uh, controlling both the motor and also it's controlling a solenoid valve to discharge water at the right point of time. Here is the circuitry of, uh, based on using a breadboard that has the controls and the logic built into it. The biggest challenge is actually trying to get power with a range of 5 to 12 volts depending on, uh, because the motor is needed, 12 volts of power to, to be delivered. So this is one of our four Galileo boards containing five different sensors, and each sensor is connected to each plant treatment. We use the moisture sensors to collect constant data and send to the iCloud. In the future, the plan is to have the Beagle and Black use the soil moisture data, current weather data, current temperature information in order to target a specific amount of water to each plant and thus control more accurately the amount of water necessary in the, in the system. I think the most fun we had during this experiment was watching the plants grow and form into full-grown pea pods and plants.